what's up guys and welcome back to my youtube channel this is me Sayed. in today's video we're gonna be talking about the uh, missions of the sword of stonewood <clears throat> so i am restarting the series where i do missions and uh help you guys out with like explain how to do the actual mission so i've planned to do this because my channel my most viewed videos are actually for challenges from stonewood uh which is these two up in arms and triangulating a circle but I recently got this account and I'm gonna be doing the rest of the challenges that I'm getting on like Stone with Plankert and Candy Valley and this is gonna be like a mission this is gonna be like a chat this is gonna be like an account where I do challenge videos on so yeah today's challenge is gonna be kicking and screaming we're gonna be doing this challenge it, it says collect distress transmissions in a 9 plus city suburban or industrial zone so you can do this in any zone and uh, a lot of the previous videos I did, it didn't show, it didn't have a lot of details, but this ones are, these ones are going to be, uh, these ones are going to be including good details, so you guys can find it, so all you have to do is go to Stonewood, and in 9 plus zones, which means like any of these zones, and uh, it says it can be done in city, suburban, or industrial, so you can just come here and choose any zone you want, for example, any mission that is going to be good for you, like right now, I might, I'm, I want to go with the parallel 9 plus mission. I want to go with this one right here. Fight the storm. I can get here. When I'm in the mission, I'll show you guys what you need to find. Let's get into the mission. Alrighty, guys. So, here's what you have to look for. All you have to do is, once you're in the mission, for... Once you get in the mission, for... If you're looking for this collect distress transmitters in a 9 plus zone. Once you're in the mission, you want to look for these exclamation marks on your map. As you can see, I have four different ones. This is the first one I'm on, and all you're going to do is come up to them and search them. All you, all you want to do is first explore your map, which is going to make it like a lot easier, because there's going to be these yellow exclamation marks on your map. You just got to open it, look at them, look where they're at, and go to them. So now we're going to go ahead and collect all four of them. As you guys can see, there we go. That's number two. I'm gonna go get the third one and then we're gonna get the fourth one and I don't know where the fifth one is but we're gonna find it usually you get them all together in one mission like you know you can just finish one quest per mission but uh yeah let's go ahead and grab that one I messed that one but it's okay so here it is it's the third one and we're gonna go ahead and grab the fourth one We're gonna go grab the fourth one, which is all the way over there. So yeah, guys, this is the simplest way to find them and get them. I'm gonna go grab the fourth one, which is over here. Yep. I don't know what happened there, but it is exactly over here. All you have to do is just find this fourth one and grab it for yourself. Let me go ahead and finish this one. I'm trying to take the screenshot for the thumbnail. But yeah, guys, there's the fourth one, that one that you're going to need to get. And you're just going to come here and grab that one. And then you'll be done. There we go. Uh, those uh, those were the four that you needed. And thank you so much for watching. You guys have an amazing rest of your day. And a special thanks to my cousin Nexus. And uh, I'm going to link his YouTube channel at the end of this video. Make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to him. And thank you so much. Have a good rest of your day.